It is small, it is cheap, it's easy to build, and it work like a charm. Behold the slim DG 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 DG. Okay, enough with that intro. This is a digital interface for the FT891 that costs less than $15 to build, including all cables. It's all you can work for in a digital interface. It's just plain working. Use it for your favorite digital mode, FT8, WinLink, SSTV, and more. And it's supported by both computers and mobile devices. So what are you waiting for? Let's build it. Here's a list of everything you need. Links are in the description. A USB hub, a USB sound card, USB A to USB cable, a PS2 cable, a USB C to USB C cable, a 3D printed case, four M2 6mm screws, and an optional four magnets for mounting on the transceiver. You will also need some tools, cable strippers, soldering iron and solder, hex keys, a 3D printer, or you may borrow from a friend. After you have 3D printed the case, the next thing you need to do is to remove the casing on the sound card. We now need to desolder the two mini jack ports on the PCB. Cut the PS2 cable in half. You may save one end for your friend that is also building this interface. Strip back the insulation on the wire and solder it onto the sound card like this. Plug the sound card and the USB-A to USB cable into the USB hub like this. Place everything into the box and attach the lid using the four M2 screws. Attach the magnets using friction, but it may also be a good idea to use a drop of super glue. Now we're done. Let's test it. So there you go, the Slim DG. And while you're on your way to a purchase on AliExpress, take a look at this. Also available on AliExpress. Links are in the description. And please remember to like and subscribe and hit the bell icon. 73.